I think it's a welcome development in the sense that it's a, a much broader framework for development um, than the Millennium Development Goals were. Um, but I, I also think that we, we mustn't lose sight of the Millennium Development Goals, which were critical, especially in a country like Nigeria. Things, things like you know, maternal um, health, infant mortality, which are still we're still struggling with, even in, in a country like Nigeria. Um, but I think the Sustainable Development Goals are a much broader framework um, that creates a platform for sustained development. And I think that's, that's the difference. Um, we, we must all embrace um, the trajectory for development that comes from these goals. Um, I, I would particularly, um, I would like us to particularly focus, especially in this part of the world, on goal number 16, which is um, peace, justice, and um, building of institutions. I think one of the, the crises um, in, in Africa is, is, is the, the dearth of institutions, the sustainability. Institutions bring sustainability. And if we don't build our institutions, then we're depending on personalities um, for progress. And once sometimes you find that you make significant progress because you have um, a strong personality at the head of an institution, but the institution itself is, isn't grounded in its goals. Um, and I think, therefore, some of the challenges, the other issues, infant mortality, uh, maternal mortality, um, peace, development, um, would be better addressed if we could build our institutions and if there's justice, if justice and peace can be sustained. Um, in Nigeria, particularly at this time, it's particularly important um, where, where a lot of things are unraveling because you know we don't we don't have we have conflict all over the country. Um, there's a sense of injustice in, in, the, in the land that is causing all sorts of insurgencies and causing all sorts of um, nationalistic movements um, that we which really should be behind us by now. We should all be focused. Um, unity and peace and progress, uh, which is one of the, the logos of our country. But I think one of the things that we have achieved in, in Nigeria, I mean, and I say we as in um, policy in, in Niger Nigeria, has been the recognition that the private sector can play a huge role in development and that indeed uh, development can only be achieved in partnership between the private sector and the government, where government um, defines policy and the federal, the uh, private sector is the engine for implementation of the various initiatives that will lead to growth and development in, in, the, in the country. And, and therefore, the private sector clearly has a huge role to play in, the, in this agenda for development. Because it cuts across the entire um, chain from hunger, poverty, alleviation, education, health. The private sector has a huge role to play in all, the, all these sectors. Um, and, and so I, I think, again, we need to engage the private sector to take charge um, of various aspects of the uh, sustainable development goals that directly concern them, directly, they can directly affect. Ideal situation, I mean, the private sector is driven by profit, um, largely. And the ideal situation is to, for government to create policies um, that do not negate that incentive of the private sector. In other words, policies that will align with the private sector's motivation for profit with the goals. And they're not mutually exclusive. I think it's to, to develop a framework in which the private sector can support government's initiatives in the health sector, in the education sector, without detracting from their primary goal, which is self-serving, as has as been described. There's no question. And I think it's a good thing, because it's the private sector that creates wealth. It's the private sector that creates jobs. It's the private sector that creates uh, opportunities for growth and development. So they're not mutually exclusive. But the private sector, corporate social responsibility is what it's called um, in, in many places. And the private sector can, can perform its role as a good corporate citizen 
um, without detracting from its primary goal of making profit and creating wealth. 